As you can see, I have a jigsaw puzzle here. 1,000 pieces, Olympic 50 pence coins, London 2012. And there they are, all the London 50 pence coins. And the old verse there. All right, let's have a look. Ooh, that's easy to peel. That's a good idea. Okay, let's see what we've got in here then. Uh -huh. Oh, they're not loose. At least they're in a bag separately. Not all loose. What's this? Some discount things there. All right, shall we get that opened? Is that just going to pull open or will I need some scissors? Oh no. Lovely, look at that. Nice quality looking pieces. Anyway, what we'll do, we'll pull them in there for now. Okay, and I was thinking what I might do first is try and do this coloured area here. That shouldn't be too difficult. So I'll have a go at doing that first. Should be quite easy to spot. Put them that side there. Right, I've sorted quite a bit of the coloured stuff out. What it is, it's the Olympic logo there, uh, the Paralympic logo for the 2012 Olympics and the Olympic rings. So let's get some of them together. What I'm going to do is start with this green bit here, because I know where that goes. I'm getting there. Look, there's another bit. And that bit. Oh, no. Yes, it does. There's a big bit of green missing from there. I suppose I better see if I can find that. Oh, there's another bit of colour there. I found two more green bits. And what 50p is that from? I think you know. We'll find out later. That's got that done then. It looks like that bit goes there, but it doesn't. There's a bigger gap. So uh, that's not the one. So what I'm going to do now is sort the edge bits out. It will take me absolutely ages, but for you, it'll be instant. Hey, there we are. That took about 10 minutes. More like 10 hours. <laughs> yeah, about 10 hours. Oh, no. That's... Look at that. It's daunting. Probably not for you jigsaw people, but for me, I haven't done a jigsaw puzzle for years. Look at that lot. What on earth is that? Oh my God. Yeah, I think we know what it is. We'll come back to that later. Next, I'm going to do this London 2012, which I hope is that. So let's get on to that. Oh, by the way, I did find, while I was doing the edge bits, I did find, uh, where is it? I did find that. And the top of the rings, I found that. Lovely. Okay, let's try this. And I hope that lot fits there. Yay. Next I'm going to do all the white areas. Because that's going to take me ages. So hopefully they're all there. I've sorted them out. Here we are, nearly an hour later. I've got lots of white bits in here. But still a lot to go. At last, I've got all the white bits in. Right, let's do a coin. Okay, I'm thinking of doing this one first. If you're a 50p collector, you'll know what it is. Yeah, it's sailing. So let's have a look out for the bits for that one. Right, that's one. I saw another one up there, I think. That one there, yeah. I think so. And over this side, there's one there. That's got to be a sailing. Yeah, see the little bloke in his boat. Right, a quick scan. I thought I saw another one over here, didn't I? Oh, there, there it is. That one. And someone along there somewhere. Yeah, that one there. Right, it took a long time to find those, but I think that's everything that makes up the salient. It's probably going to take me an hour to put that together, but I'll speed it up about a million times. Let's just zoom in a little bit. Right, here we go. Let's do the letters first.
I've got one more bit there. Okay, there's a couple more to find, but it's more or less done. And there it is, the sailing 50 pence coin. So let's put that there. I'll pick a few random bits, see if you know what they are. That's easy. That's going to be archery. The archer's fingers. So that'll go in that area somewhere, around about there. And there's a few more archery bits in place there. And this bit is the archer's finger. I'm going to leave archery for now because it's proving quite difficult because look at all the blank areas around there. I'm going to try a different one. I'm going to try this one. Do you know what it is? Yeah, it's basketball. And the reason I'm going to go for that is because it's got a mottled surface all over. Like a basketball finish should be easy to spot. There's one. There's another one. And there's another one. I've got most of the basketball done, but that middle bit is proving elusive. But I think I've found it. Is that it? Yep. Yes, get in there. Also, I found that as well. I think that's that bit. Yes, it is. So that will join up with that bit. Like that. And there is the basketball coin. So I'll put that there. I found all the bits for aquatics. That went together quite easily. So that should actually fit up there, shouldn't it? Let's see if I can get it in there. It's fallen to bits. That's it. Now I just need one piece of the arrow to join up with archery. Let's see if I can find it. Shout out if you can see it. No, nope. found it, there it is. So that should go in there and we can join them up. Look at that. And there is the Aquatics 50 pence. So Aquatics 50p can go there. Next, I think I'll do wheelchair rugby. Still loads left. I can spot some of the wheelchair rugby. That's got to be one, surely. And that. That's got to be part of a wheel. And that one as well. Okay, I've got the stripey bits. They're definitely right. That bit goes there. I think these all look like wheelchair rugby bits. Ooh, got most of it. I've got to find these now. What's that from? It's like two little men. Ah, I know. I'll come back to that. I'll do that next. I found that bit. Also found that, that bit there. Uh, what else did I find? I found that bit. I think that's right. Yep. Yeah. And that bit. And I found some bits for the obverse around there, so I think I'll do that next. That's going to be difficult. But first, we'll have a look at the wheelchair rugby 50p. And put it down there. It wasn't too bad. Uh, that bit there that I thought was two little men was obviously the top of the tiara. And what else? That bit there. And this bit took ages to find. But that goes there. All the coins are dated 2011 but they commemorate the 2012 London Olympics. One more bit found for the volleyball but still not complete yet. Next I'm gonna go for tennis which goes just there. Uh, 
It must fit on there. Yes, it does. What about this? Yeah, I can't find this top bit here or this one. Uh, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go for canoeing and hockey and see if it all comes together down there. You puzzle people are saying, you've got no strategy whatsoever. Well, I haven't, I admit. I haven't done a jigsaw puzzle for about 15 years. And that only had about four pieces. She looks like a hockey player to me. And he has got to be a canoeist. I'm getting some of the hockey together. Not doing too good on the canoodling, though. I found a couple more bits, but I'm not having a lot of luck with this, so I'll try something different. This bit I showed you earlier, that's obviously table tennis. So I'm going to sort all the table tennis ones out that obviously are table tennis and put them there. Wrestling I've started to sort out. Uh, rowing. So I'm going to do that for everything. This one I think is difficult. Do you know what that is? This reminds me when I used to do live streams and we used to guess parts of a coin. And I used this very part of a coin in the video. If I can find it, I'll put a clip up there. You've all seen it. It's difficult. It is really difficult. Boxing. I've got to shrink it right down though to get this. And then I've got to enlarge it with this. Look at that. It's boxing. Uh, I told you it was difficult. I can't believe that was three years ago. Anyway, it's boxing, so it's got to go up there. It's coming together, slowly. I think I've got enough boxing pieces now. Let's try and get some of these together. Uh, still more to find. Not doing too bad on the wrestling. Another one for you to guess. What's that from? Yeah, see, it's handball. Quite easy, that one, wasn't it? That's going to be underneath the boxing. I think they're handball as well. So we'll put those in the right place. The rowing is coming together. I've got another bit here. Hmm, not there, is it? What was that? Ah, there we go, there. In fact, I think that might even join up. Yes, it does. It joins up to the sailing. Okay, I've got all these joined up now. Sailing joined up to wheelchair rugby, and I believe that bit goes there. Yes, it does for wrestling. Oh, that's nearly done. Let's have a look at the wrestling coin. There it is. That is one of the harder to find Olympic 50Ps. Very nice. So that can go there. I got this jigsaw from a company called Puzzle U. So what you do, you send them your image and they make a jigsaw out of it for you. Uh, it cost me 30 quid, 32 I think it was, uh, but it's really good quality box, uh, lovely quality pieces, so I can't complain too much because it is unique. I just wish I'd have used a little bit more of these white areas up and, and spread them out a bit. Spread them out a bit in the software before I did the image to send them. Never mind. And just to be clear, I'm not sponsored by them or anything like that. The size is 25 inches by 19 inches, or if you prefer, 64 by 48 centimetres. A few more pieces in place. There's the football coin here with the offside rule. I found a bit of those. Let's get those together. Oh, that bit must go in there. Does it? Oh, it does, yeah. So where's that go? About there, I think. Yeah, it goes below. I thought I had more bits than that. Right, half an hour later, got quite a bit done. A um, bit more of the offside done and nearly finished the volleyball. So let's have a look at the volleyball coin. There it is. Yeah, I do like that design. So that can go down there. My favourite of the Olympic 50Ps. There's another one complete, weightlifting. Didn't take too long at all. And there is Olympic weightlifting. Very basic design. Some people like it. There it goes. Getting on really well now. Uh, that looks like that bit on the tennis. And it is, so I'm going to say that's complete. And there it is, Olympic tennis. Down it goes. I'm doing the fencing and it looks like that lot should be around there. 
going to go in? Yes. I've nearly got the offside done, the football coin. I'm going to try the horse next with the uh, equestrian. And boxing is complete. And there's the boxing coin with the boxing gloves. Let's get that down there. Botcher is proving difficult. Here we go. Where do you think that's from? What sport is that? It's judo. It's the guy's head at the bottom there. And you can just see this bar there. Judo goes above the tennis, but I think this is the only piece I've got so far. So that will go about there. I have got another piece. Look, I've got the foot sticking up there. A few more judo bits there, but hockey is complete. So let's have a look at the hockey coin. There it is. So I can go down there. You would think it would be getting easier with a few bits left, but it's not. Okay, it's next morning now. Got a few more bits done, as you can see. I just need two more bits for the canoeing. Let's have a look. Can you see it? Can't see it there. What about the other side? It's got to be that, isn't it? It's got to be that bit. No, nothing like it. Not even the right shape, that one. Right, I found that bit. That's got to be there. Yes. At last, I've got it. Lovely. And there is the canoeing 50 pence coin. So let's put it down there. Next, I've got the modern pentathlon here. I've found a few bits, but uh, I'm hoping these do. That definitely does, and that. So let's see if we can get any of this together. Thought I had more bits than that. Is that part of it? Oh, yes. And that bit goes there. I've just found that bit. I think I know where that's from. Any guesses? I think it's from a triathlon. Yes, it's his back foot. I was looking for this bit here. That says offside there, and this would say not offside. So I was looking for the offside, but it's not there, is it? It's just going to be part of the O because I've covered it up with the other coin. And after a lot of searching, I think that's it. Oh, yes, it is. I'm quite enjoying this. I didn't think I would. If you want me to do more of these, let me know in the comments. And can I ask you to subscribe, please? You don't get if you don't ask. And click that like button. Thank you. Do you know what coin that is from? Yeah, it's from Gold Ball. And there's the bell inside the ball. It's a game for the visually impaired. They all have to wear masks over their eyes to make it even for everybody. And um, listen to the bell in the ball to play the game. It's quite interesting. I've watched that recently. So that will be right over here. And I think that is his foot. That foot. So that's got to be over that way somewhere as well. I think that's triathlon. I think that's the cyclist's ass. It is. Well, we're coming up to 20 minutes now. Are you still watching? Well, you've got to admit it's better than anything on the BBC, isn't it? What I'm going to do now is try and finish the football and the handball. So I may be gone sometime. Does anybody know what that's from? I've been picking it up, putting it down. Well, I can't work out where it goes. Well, we'll find out eventually. Anyway, football, that's more or less done. And the handball, that, I hope, is the last bit. Oh, apart from that little bit there, but never mind. There's the football 50p, or the offside rule explained. If you don't know the offside rule, take a five second look at this coin and you'll understand. Wouldn't that have been better if it was just a footballer striking a ball towards the goal? It would be so much better than this rubbish, wouldn't it? It is the rarest of the circulating 50p coins, so look out for that. Selling for around 12 to 15 pounds at the moment. And there is the handball 50 pence. Olympic handball. We'll go there.
I've got some bits here that I hope are athletics. So let's see if I can put these together. Uh, perhaps not that bit. I think that's part of the botcher. I think that goes there. And it does, yeah. Taekwondo, I've got a few bits here that I hope will go in place. Well, I've got those, so that should fit in the corner there, but I thought there was more. I thought that bit was part of Taekwondo, but I've scoured it and it looks like it's the shooter's goggles. So it must go there. Yes. I've got quite a few more bits in and that looks like the last bit of the badminton. There it is. And there's the badminton Olympic 50 pence with the shuttlecock or the Dalek. Another one bites the dust. I found a few shooting bits, so that goes there. Then that one, that one, no, not there. That one, oh, I thought I'd got that, but I haven't. There it is. Right, two, I'm about to finish. That is Botcher. And this one is, I hope it is, Athletics. There's Athletics with the high jumper going backwards over the bar. That's that one. And there's the Botcher. That's definitely how it's pronounced, not Botcher, like some people say. Botcher. This is a Para Olympic coin. You can see the Para Olympic logo at the top there. There's no Olympic rings on there. That's that one. Not doing too bad. A lot of blanks there now. A lot of blank areas to find. So that's going to be difficult for me. There's quite a lot of pieces like that. This bit I was looking for earlier. Did you work out where it went? Because I found it. It goes just there. In the pentathlon. The swimmer's head. Is that an arm? Uh, it could be a foot. It's got to be the Taekwondo guy. Yeah, there it goes. There's one of those blank areas, and I think it's that one. Yes, it is. And the field of the coin is blank. Oh. There it is. Two more approaching completion. There we have the archery. That's uh, para-Olympic archery. That's the most common of the Olympic 50Ps. That's the easiest one to find. That will go there. And Rowan. Goes there somehow. There it is. And I do have the Rowan of 50 pence here. What does it say? Excellent friendship, fair play, respect. And then same again down there. Oh, a few more finished. We have Equestrian. There's a horse. It's supposed to be a horse anyway. Which can go down there. There's Fencing. A fencing, Olympic Fencing, 50 pence, which can go down there. And there is the Paralympic goal ball, which is that one. There's Olympic shooting, and that can go there. And we also have the table tennis, that's complete, and that's a Paralympic table tennis. There's the triathlon coin. Because triathlon is now completed. And if I put this piece in here, which we get the right way around, that completes judo and pentathlon. There's judo. And there is pentathlon, modern pentathlon. Gymnastics, that's completed. There's one more bit for cycling, which has got to be there. <laughs> There's the cycling coin. 
Just one piece left. Can you see where it goes? And there it is, the very last piece. Olympic Taekwondo. And that is it. And there it is complete. Let's have a look without the coins on it. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Um, please subscribe if you haven't already. Click the like button, as I said earlier, and I'll see you in the next video.